Max and Ruby. Ruby and Max. Max and Ruby. Ruby and her little brother Max. Max's castle. <laughs> Just a little bit this way. It takes a special skill to make the castle fit for a princess. More? <gasps> Max! It's not how many blocks you use, it's how you use the blocks. <gasps> that must be Louise now! Don't do anything to our castle. Thanks, Max. More. Hi, Ruby. Look what I brought. Ooh. Picture perfect castles. It has all kinds of pictures of beautiful castles. Ooh. Now we can make sure the castle we build for our princess is perfect. I've started building the castle in the backyard. <gasps> More! Max. Max! Max! What did you do? More? Remember what I told you, Max? More doesn't mean better. Louise and I want our castle to be perfect. See? Come on, Max. Now, Max, I want you to play with your toys here while Louise and I build our castle over there. Okay? <laughs> Thanks, Max. More. <sighs> Let's get started. More? <gasps> Max, I told you more doesn't mean better. We want our castle to look just like this picture. Picture perfect! <laughs> exactly. Come on, Max. You've got lots of toys to play with over on your side of the yard. There must be something you want to play with here. Your wagon! Great choice, Max. You play with that and let us make our castle, okay? Louise! You made a turret! I thought it was a tower. A turret is what they call a tower when it's part of a castle. See? Well, I made the turret out of all the blocks Max dumped there. What do you think? Perfect. Now let's see. What else does our castle need? Look! There's something on top of the tower! Uh, I mean, turret. <laughs> A flag. And I know just where to get one. Come on, Louise. Remember, Max, don't touch the castle. <laughs> Thanks, Max. Roar. What are you looking for, Ruby? Aha! Here it is! It'll make a perfect flag for our castle, Ruby! Perfect! perfect. Max, stop! <laughs> Max, I know you think more is better, but Louise and I are trying to finish the stairs for our castle. Uh, Ruby? You should see this. Just a second, Louise. Come on, Max. Let's go back over to your toys. Look, Max. Here's your screaming green alien gorilla and your dump -a lump dump truck. Why don't you play with them? More. Louise, that's just like the stairway in the picture. Well, the blocks that Max dumped here look kind of like a stairway. So I just fixed it up 
and it worked! Perfect. There's just one thing it needs. What, Ruby? Decorations. You're so right. Look, Louise, these will make perfect bunting. Bunting? What's that, Ruby? It's what they used to call streamers in the olden days of castles and princesses. Oh, you're right, Ruby. It's perfect bunting. <laughs> <laughs> <gasps> Max, what did you do? Ruby, look! It's a perfect archway for our castle. You're right, Louise. And look, now that we have the archway, we need a coat of arms. That's what they call this shield thing. You know everything about castles. Come on. And Max, we were lucky that time. But please don't do anything to our castle, okay? Thanks, Max. Now, where is that? Aha! The shield from Max's deputy bunny. How did it get stuck on Rapunzel? <gasps> she can be our princess! Of course! <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll put the coat of arms over the archway, and you put Rapunzel on the stairs so she can receive her guests for the ball. Perfect. Picture perfect. Hmm. There's just one more thing we need. A, A handsome, handsome prince. prince. <gasps> Max! I don't believe it. You kept adding more and more and more, and now our castle is just perfect! Bunny Hopscotch. Stone! How does that look, Louise? It's perfect, Ruby. Pink is definitely the right color for hopscotch. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Max, stop. You nearly smudged our hopscotch lines with your cement mixer. Louise and I are going to play hopscotch on the walkway. You know how to play hopscotch, don't you, Max? Tell him while I draw in the numbers, Ruby. Good idea, Louise. See, Max, each square has a number in it, and each player has a stone to play with. Stones? Yes. First, you have to throw your stone in the number one square without touching any of the lines. Right. Then you hop in each of the squares except for the square that your stone is in without stepping on any of the lines. Right. Then you turn around and you hop back down. And when you get back to the square where your stone is, you have to pick it up. Whoa! Without, without losing, losing your, your balance. balance. <laughs> <laughs> and hop home. If you do the whole thing without falling, or stepping on a line. You throw your stone onto the next square. See, Max? Stones? Yes. It's very difficult, and you have to concentrate very hard, or you'll lose your balance. Or step on a line. <laughs> right, Louise. <laughs> 
So we need you to take your cement mixer and your stones. Right. And play over there. Thanks, Max. Okay, Louise, let's play. Aren't you forgetting something, Ruby? What? Stones! Stones! Yes, Max, you have lots of stones. Can we pick out two of your stones so we can play hopscotch? <laughs> stones! Oh. Ah. There's lots to pick from here. I found mine. It's small and flat. And look, it's got a pretty pink stripe right through the middle of it. Oh, Louise. Look at this one. It's flat and it's sparkly all over. Beautiful. Thanks, Max. Okay, here goes my beautiful sparkly stone right into that number one square. Okay, here I go. Whoa! <gasps> Way to go, Ruby! You got to ten! Stones! <gasps> Whoa! Max, we're playing hopscotch here. You have to play with your cement mixer somewhere else. <sighs> vroom, vroom, vroom. Thanks, Max. Okay, Ruby, you can still do it. You haven't lost your balance, and you haven't stepped on a line. All right. Here goes. Don't forget to pick up your stone. My stone is gone. <laughs> Max. You've got my nice, sparkly hopscotch stone. May I have it back, please? Here it is. Stones! Yes, Max, you play with your stones. Every stone but this one. <sighs> your turn, Louise. Okay, Ruby. Wow, Louise. You're really good at hopscotch. It just takes practice. Your turn. All right, here goes. Good throw. <gasps> you made it to number 10 without stepping on any lines. Now I just have to turn around without losing my balance. Stones. Whoa! Uh, I hate to tell you this, but... Oh, you made me step on the line. Max, can you please pick up all these stones and take your cement mixer over there? That's better. Now we'll have to start all over again. Oh, <gasps> Max. Got my stone again. Beautiful. Thanks, Max. Try again, Ruby. Max shouldn't bother you this time. Oh, little brothers. Here goes. It's a good throw. Now, concentrate and hop. Whoa. Phew. See? You're getting better! <laughs> Not again. Stones! Max, how many times do I have to tell you we need to keep your stones off of our hopscotch game? 
Ruby, do you realize what you just did? I hopped through all the hopscotch squares without losing my balance. Or stepping on the lines. And I picked up all of the stones. Max's Grasshopper. Hi, Louise. You're just in time to see my bunny scout measuring experiment. You'll never guess what I've done. Fire! Max! <laughs> Higher! Look, Ruby! Max has a grasshopper friend. Hmm. You could call him Hoppy. That's a cute name. Do you like that name, Max? Hoppy! <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Max! Bye, Hoppy! Are you ready to see the experiment? Where is it? Right here, in the garden. What kind of plants are those? They're bean plants. They grow so fast, you can actually measure how much they grow from one day to the next. Bean plants? I never would have thought of that. How does your measuring experiment work? Well, I planted six beans in the ground, and then right beside each of them, I stuck a measuring stick in the dirt. Then, every day, I mark how much the bean plants have grown. See? Higher! Oh! Max. You and Hoppy need to have your hopping contest someplace else. Bunny Scout Leader is coming over to see my measuring experiment. Hop! Okay, Max. Why don't you and Hoppy hop that way? Higher! Thanks, Max. And Hoppy. We'd better get measuring. See, Louise? This pink mark shows how tall this bean plant was two days ago, and this blue mark shows how tall it was yesterday. Wow! It grew that much in one day? Amazing, isn't it? Okay, now let's see how much the bean plant has grown since yesterday. What do you want me to do? While I hold the bean plant up to the measuring stick, you can mark how tall it is today. Okay, Louise? Okay, Ruby. Wow, look at that, Ruby! It's higher than the blue mark! That means the bean plant has grown again! I know! Okay, you can mark it now, Louise. Uh, what should I mark it with? Oh, <laughs> silly me! I forgot my color markers inside. Come on! <laughs> <laughs> hop higher! Hop higher! Whoa! Max! We're going inside for just a minute. Make sure nothing happens to my bean plants. Okay, Max? <laughs> Thanks, Max. Hop! Higher! I've used a blue marker and I've used a pink marker. Which color should I use today? <gasps> Red! <laughs> okay, Louise. I'll hold the bean plant up to the measuring stick and mark how tall the bean plant is today. Okay, Ruby. <gasps> uh, Ruby, where's the measuring stick? Higher. Hop. Max. <laughs> <laughs> wow, look at that, Ruby. Poppy hopped as high as the blue mark on your measuring stick. That's nice. But I need that measuring stick for my experiment. Max, can you and Hoppy please give me my stick and go hop someplace else? <laughs> Thanks, Max. Come on, Louise. Let's have a hopping race. <laughs> Louise. <laughs> okay, let's measure the first bean plant. This time with the measuring stick and the marker. Right, Ruby. 
Okay, Louise. Ready? Mark! Wow! Look how much he grew in one day! Yeah! Now let's go to the next bean plant. All right, I'll hold it up against the plant and you mark it again. We make a good team, Ruby. Huh? That's strange. This bean plant is shorter than it was yesterday, not taller. Let's look at the next one. It's even shorter than the last one. What's that munching sound? I don't know, Ruby. Puppy, what are you doing? Oh, no. Hoppy's eating my bean plant. Wow! Did you see that hop? He hopped right up to here. Higher. <gasps> Ruby, look at Hoppy hop. Higher. But what about my bean plants? It looks like the more bean plants he eats, the higher he hops. Maybe the bean plants gave him more energy. Are you thinking what I'm thinking, Louise? I think so. <gasps> Let's measure how high Hoppy hops. Okay, Louise, are you ready to measure? Ready, Ruby. Okay, Hoppy, hop. I got it. Hello. Are you back here, Bunny Scout Ruby? Over here, Bunny Scout Leader. Hello, Bunny Scout Ruby. Hello, Bunny Scout Louise. Hello, Hello Bunny, Bunny Scout, Scout Leader. Are you ready to show me your measuring experiment? Yes, we are. Our experiment was to show how much higher a grasshopper can hop if it has more energy. This is how high Hoppy the Grasshopper hopped after he ate one bean plant. And this is how high he hopped after he ate two bean plants. And this is how high he hopped after he ate three and four bean plants. Well done, Bunny Scouts. And what have you learned from this? After eating more bean plants, Hoppy the Grasshopper was able to hop higher. 